Hi guys, Maneki Mochi here. Welcome back to episode 20 of Stardew Valley. Last episode, we added another chicky. I ran out of memory on my memory card. So you were watching my Stardew avatar the whole time, most of the time. So sorry about that. It was a long day. It was the end of all my recordings and I didn't feel like re-recording it. But yeah, anyways, let's see what happens in this episode. I'm so excited. I don't know if I said this in the last episode, but I realized that we could have ostriches and now I just want a coop full of ostriches. <laughs> All right. Oh. Let's pick the veggies. Oh. I don't know if grass blocks the bee house, but yeah. Oh. Hmm. Where are we? Oh, we're on the 27th. So this is the, rude, the last day of summer. Where were we? Uh, oh, this one. So I'm afraid to plant anything. That's what it was. Because in my other game, it seems like... Hi, Boba. It seems like when I planted stuff, even it, if it was fall and... Hi, Ube, Oolong, and Nugget. It seems like... How come I have four? I have three chickens though. Oh no! I have Nugget and who else? Who are all my pets again? Potatoes! That's right! <laughs> yes. Um. <laughs> Sorry. It seems like even if I plant stuff that grows in summer and fall, when it changed to fall, the plants died. But maybe that's all in my head. Maybe I don't remember it correctly. Also, did you know you don't have to uh, feed your... Or water... Give water to your pets. They'll love you no matter what. I couldn't believe it. Is that a large white egg? Uh, okay. I'll do it after. Okay, great. They have a lot of grass. Still don't have any maple syrup. That's awesome. Uh, where's the other oak? Nothing. Oh, we gotta upgrade our copper axe to steel. Wait, or does copper... Does copper do the hardwood? Do I have my... Yeah, I do. I don't know. Let's see. Oh, it does. I thought you had to get steel. It's only for that big... Uh... There it is. It's only for the big... Um... Log. Logs. That... Takes you into the secret forest, I think it's called. Or like this log, see? Right here. Ooh. Oh, let's do this one. What should we do today? Since we can't really. Oh, but you know what? I think the corn lasts. So maybe I can plant. Mm, should I try it, guys? Watch just all my seeds just get obliterated. Maybe I'll do like... Hmm. I'll just do that. 
Oh, I could do the automatic watering one. Also, I learned if you just keep your hand on the... If you just keep on clicking your mouse, like just hold it down, is what I'm trying to say, and you direct it, it'll keep watering. I learned that. I was so excited. I don't have to keep clicking anymore. Although, I guess it's like, um, driving. You know when you got it wrong tool. You know when you gotta keep your foot down if you're, especially if you're driving manual. Your calf hurts after a while. <laughs> Like if you're in traffic. Should I try guys? Let's just do it. It's only like 10 cents. I talk as if I'm rich. <laughs> oh my god, the seeds too. You just keep it hold. Keep your mouse held down. Keep it clicked. That's so cool. Oops. These already are fertilized. Okay. They're... What do I have? Melon. Broccoli. Broccoli for the fall. Okay, cool. keep the lights in, in case we go mining because I don't want to forget <laughs> oh wait what was cord in here yeah <laughs> oolong ube nugget and potato so cute <gasps> wait I should save one for Just save one for mining. Okay, do we have mushrooms? And I'm oblivious sometimes. This is a dehydrator. On my other game, I spent the, I bought the dehydrator recipe from Pierre, and I bought it. I mean, and I made it. And I realized that it was in the cave already. It's okay. Now I know. I wonder if you could move it. Anyways, it sells for a lot. Okay, so... Let's go. Let's go mining. I also learned you can get a pet turtle, which I'm so excited because I love turtles or tortoises or both. You just buy it from Marnie. <laughs> so exciting. Oh wait, where am I going? Let's go visit Robin. Robin, my bestie. Our house is in such a beautiful area, don't you think? Yeah. I love the fresh air of the mountains. Robin, you are me when I'm older. Okay. Our next building... Oh yeah, we're gonna up upgrade to the deluxe coop, right? Where is it? Or is it big coop? Big coop. Because I want to eventually get to the deluxe coop. No. No, it is Deluxe Coop. I think I have to build it first. 
anyways the one that f automatically feeds the animals because that takes up so much time if i can get an auto feeder that's great hi linus oh everyone's by the lake today i'm happy by myself you know that's great i don't need new friends well you're gonna be my friend hi abigail you can't miss tomorrow's festival. It's one of the most beautiful wonders of the valley. What's tomorrow? Okay. End of summer festival? I don't know. Hey, have any interesting farm stories to tell me? Sure, Maru. Guess not. <laughs> I said sure. I guess you don't want to hear it. Well, more food. I finally have the light, bitches. Oh my god. Is this how it goes? It's okay, we'll leave it there for now. Should we? Nah. Excuse me. Oh god. Oh god. <gasps> oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Where is he? Oh, he's stuck. I like how I failed to choose a gender in the beginning. And now I'm just like a... Oh, what would you describe? Envy? Maybe? Like non-binary? Because I don't really adhere to a gender. Socially constructed gender. Was that? Oh, I thought that was a ladder. Oh, there's a ladder. Oh, there's another ladder. hey -o. Uh, should I take it with me? I guess so. <laughs> Ooh! <gasps> yes! Oh! How come there's so many lights? I love it. <gasps> no, 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 no! It doesn't work for swords. If you hold down your mouse, it doesn't keep going. <laughs> You just have to keep clicking. Oh no, where are you? Bats are annoying. Give me your bat wings. Thank you. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. I kind of want to do a series where I do each of the different farms, you know? Like a Meadowlands, uh, the spooky one. A... I don't know about the beach if I should do... Wow, I'm moving myself? <laughs> Just by hitting. I don't know if I would do another beach one. Or if... Um... Oh. Or if I should just continue the one I have. Hello? Oh god. Oh god. Where is he? Where is he? Hello? Can we hurry up? Oh, finally. Is there anything good? Nah, 
Let's go. Oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god, oh god. Ah! I'm trying to train myself to use the mouse scroll to change between weapons and the menu bar, basically. Oh, another one already? Should I just go? Yeah, let's just go. Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Where is it? Oh, there. Ah, finally. <gasps> Let's just go. <laughs> Oh, there's a ladder. Let's go, let's go, let's go. No, <laughs> give me the light, give me the light. Let's go, let's go, let's go. Yay, we made it to 40. A slingshot, nice. I've not used a slingshot in my other one, so I really don't know. Let's go. I really don't know what to use it for, so. I really gotta start putting lights out here. It's so dark. Maybe we'll come back and put lights tomorrow. Ooh. Let's sell this, let's sell this, let's sell this. Save one. No need. Um. Mm -mm. Oh, I do have foraging in there. Nice. Okay. Hi, Boba. Good night, Boba. <laughs> Okay, tomorrow's the last day of summer. Nice. <laughs> Dear Maneki Mochi, tonight at around 10 o'clock p.m., a rare and beautiful event will take place. Ah, oh, the Moonlight Jellies will be passing by Pelican Town on their long journey south for the winter. We're all gathering at the beach to watch. You don't want to miss this. See you tonight, Demetrius. Cool. Summer Spangle, yum. I should go buy more seeds. Oh wait, what am I doing? I'm supposed to say hi to the to the children first. Oh, hello, Miss the Bull. Oh. Hi Boba. Hi Oolong. Hi Ube. Hi Nugget. Hi Potato. Oh. 
Egg blocking my way. I should save the honey. Uh, let's go into town real quick. Oh, I should water. Why is this? When did I get that journal entry? Did I miss something? Um... Okay, let's go. Anything to forage up here? Oh, I also learned that the foraging resets every Saturday, so you don't have to forage every day. That is such a good tip. What do I have left? A lot, I bet. Quality crops. Duck egg. Oh, these are things I don't have. Fall crops, okay. I'm just gonna buy wheat. Check the board. Dance of the Moonlight Jellies. Hello, Pierre. Are you excited for tonight? Oh, it's so hot in here. Ooh. Climate change, am I right? Um. What? Continues to continues to what grows in fall as well? Just corn. Yeah, hops is corn. Yeah, sunflower, sunflower too. Do I have sunflower seeds? Um, I should plant some. Okay, let's get more wheat. And if you right click, if you right click when you buy something and just hold it down, it goes faster. <laughs> it's perfect. Okay, I'm gonna dig through people's trash cans. Don't judge me. I'm poor, what do you expect? Oh, thank goodness he's not outside. Oh, I'll take that. Let's see if anything is going down at the beach. Oh yeah. Just kidding. No, I won't. Hmm. So I read. Oh, what's up, Jody? I read. What in the world am I going to make for dinner? Fish? Jody, I feel you though. I have to plan dinner every week. And I swear, it just doesn't get any easier. <laughs> Anyways, I read this small study about um, caffeine and how it affects lupus. And it's like if you drink, I think it was 180 milligrams between like 150, 180 milligrams or something, which is two cups of coffee. Cause I think one cup is like 90 milligrams. So eight ounces, 
but two cups, so 16 ounces of coffee. It helps keep the autoimmune disease in remission. And I was like, yes, please. Let me try that. So now I drink a little bit more coffee. <laughs> I drink it in my Totoro cup. I left. Because... Did I grow that? I mean, grow. Did I ship that yet? I did. I mean, I could ship it some more. I have 12. So yeah, if you didn't know, I may have been diagnosed with lupus. It came back positive on a test. My doctor was supposed to retest my blood but I never heard back from him and honestly I don't have the money right now F oh shit I forgot a call I don't have the money right now to treat anything so if we're being honest you know maybe I should wait I'll wait till tomorrow to plant the sunflower So, and then I read that it's really hard to like test for lupus. Like it's mostly based on symptoms. So, there's that. And the thing about chronic illnesses is that you cannot be cured from them. You have to be, um, let's make some lights. You just, it can only go in remission. Ooh, this and this. Hmm. 40 should be good. Well, let's see. Gosh, it'd be easier at night. <laughs> oh, I didn't mean to put it there, but okay. So yeah, the thing about chronic illness is that, or autoimmune diseases is that or both. Can't just get better. It just has to be managed. Which sucks. It's, life's not fair. Am I right? But I... Well, I don't want to... Give any... Kind of... Inside, I kind of don't want to, like, confirm that I have it. Because then it makes it real, in a sense. <sighs> but I do have, like, unexplained fatigue. Like, I just don't understand why I get so tired sometimes. It just makes no sense. What the heck? I don't get it. I do have joint pain, but it's because I have, um, because I work out. That's what I think it is. I lift weights, so. Um, should we cut down more trees? Yeah, let's cut down more trees. Um, that's for mining. Hmm. We'll deal with it when it comes up, which will be quick. My low energy. So real. Well, why is it getting a different one?
Jeez, there's so many little... Little trees. Already. I have a stump here. What is that? Is that a rock? Oh, it is. <laughs> and this is a tree. Oh, I need something to eat. I was like, I can make a field snack here. No, I cannot. Is the mayonnaise done? <gasps> I hear something. Yep. Let's have one. <laughs> nice. That's all it gave me, though. Hmm. Oh, where did I get coal from? Oh, the stones. Okay, let's go. Oh, jeez, they're everywhere. How's everyone's weekend? Oh, this past weekend, I uh, had to redo this area that we have a fountain. I, re I cleaned up the fountain. There was a lot of algae. It was gross. <laughs> and um. I keep the fountain mostly for the birds. We have a couple hummingbirds that come by and uh, drink water from it. It's really cute. But man, the weather was like 110 degrees. <laughs> it was crazy. But I really needed to get it done. I wasn't able to get it done. And I also like redid my plants and the irrigation. I wasn't able to get it done earlier because I was taking care of the kitties and they were kind of like blocking the access to get stuff like that done. They're in a room that I couldn't like walk through to get to the outside which has all my tools and stuff. If we went around it would be just way too much work. So I was finally able to repot a bunch of stuff, to dig up a lot of stuff, and I reconfigured my... We have an hour left. I have six minutes, guys. Six minutes. Yeah, so I redid the irrigation. It looks amazing. It looks way more open now. I moved this tree we have that volunteer it was a it's a volunteer um what do you call what are those things called yeah 
Um, mulberry. It's a volunteer mulberry tree that grew in one of the pots, so I just let it grow. And we moved it so that it kind of shades the fountain now. It looks really cool. I'll put in a picture if I remember. But all the plants that I should have started earlier in, um, in spring, I wasn't able to, which sucks. But it is what it is. Yay! Hello, Marnie. That's a heavy load of people for an ancient wooden dock. I'll stay over here near the beach. Marnie's got a point, though. I can't believe summer's over. I feel like it just started. Sure, Alex. I'm gonna take a picture of the jellies when they arrive. Haley, you're so cute. Hi, Penny. Life is just so easy for jellyfish. Just letting the waves carry you onward forever. What's up, Gus? Moonlight jellies? I wonder how they taste. I would never try it, of course. Yeah, I wonder. Hey, Pam. Don't tell Gus, but I'm a little disappointed there's no buffet tonight. <laughs> Always hungry, Pam, but I get it. When you're poor, <laughs> you try and see it where there's any free food. I want to see the rare green jelly. Me too, Vincent. Hey, Seb. I thought I saw something moving in there. Something big, something dark. It's a shark. Just trying to scare you. Oh. What's up, Sam? I wonder if they're poisonous. Maybe I shouldn't push Sebastian in the water after all. Sam, why are you such a villain? Such a rare and exciting thing. Yeah, it is, Abigail. You know your brother is a dick, right? Don't become like him when you grow up, Vincent, please. Hi, Shane. The jellies were here a year ago, and they'll be back again a year from now. Nature is amazing, right? Shane gets it. Hi, Jazz. I hope there are babies this year. Good evening, Manekimochi. Good evening, Mayor. The moonlight jellies are close. I already saw one glowing in the distance. Once we launch the candle boat, they'll come up to the docks and say hello. Okay, I'll let you know. Hi, Uncle Willie. Most night fish would be scared of the light. These are strange ones. What's up, Jody? There, I just saw something glowing. Oh, it's gone. Hi, Emily. Look out there. At the endless sea, deep underwater, all kinds of life forms are moving around the dark. Eerie, isn't it? Hello, Clint. Hovering near Emily, are we? I wore my special shoes tonight. No one noticed. Oh, I like your special shoes. I saw... I don't know if it was AI or someone drew it. Um, but I saw like a rendering of in real life what some of the characters would look like elliot spot on <laughs> if we keep polluting the oceans the jellies will surely go extinct it's already in the process of happening what a shame we have no respect for nature anymore <gasps> elliot yes i totally get it all right yes let's launch The light's like, come, moonlight jellies. <laughs> come perform for us. Wow. So cute. What if you pull up to the beach and you just hear this bot playing? Like, yes, I'm gonna go sit with them. <laughs> Let me go hang out with the Stardew crew. <laughs> My 
my bow is so cute. Oh, not non-binary. I just saw this. It would be gender fluid. Oh no, I guess it is non-binary too though. Anyways, the glow of summer has faded now and the moonlight jellies carry on toward the great unknown. Cute. Yay! Okay. Uh, we can cut down one more tree. <laughs> Actually, I kind of want to make start making a path. Uh, do I have? I do. Ooh, I got an achievement. What was it? Craft 15 different items. Got it. My dog is, is, um, dreamy. She's barking at something or chasing something. <laughs> She's so cute. Oh. Do you hear her? Oh my gosh, she's so cute. She's getting so old though. She's... Let's see. Um, wait, why did I go that far? Wait, I have to do this in my head. She's 13. I know. Do you hear her? She's so cute. <laughs> okay. Um. Oh, there we go. Make one to. Oh shit! Oh shit! I gotta go inside. I gotta go inside. I gotta go inside. I gotta go inside. Go 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 go. <gasps> I just made it. <laughs> Level six foraging plus one axe proficiency. Nice lightning rod. Wild seeds. <gasps> So mushrooms, nice. Warp totem beach. Okay, cool. Yay. Wow, it's worth 50. That would be less. Nice. Good morning. <laughs> All right, guys. Thank you so much for watching. Please make sure to subscribe. Hit that notification bell to let you know every time I drop a new video. Please like and comment below, and I hope you have a great day. Bye! Free Congo.